We talked beforehand about just some of the guys from this era, but we talked about Bobby the Brain Heenan. Can you talk about your relationship with Bobby Heenan and what he was like backstage? Well, I first met Bobby Heenan when I was wrestling for Dick the Bruiser with Don Fargo. And uh, he was wrestling, and then he became a man. He would wrestle, and then he'd come out and manage somebody, and he always took those bumps over the top rope. He took bumps like Ric Flair did. And uh, very nice guy, always very smart guy. Had a beautiful wife and daughter, and just a great guy. It's so sad what happened to him, you know, getting the cancer. And, but a lot of, a lot of good trips with Bobby the Brain Heenan, and he was the brain. He was a great commentator. He was a great manager. Never had the luxury of him managing me, but he, he, he managed all the greats. What a talker, what a guy. Lived in Florida, eventually moved to Florida from Minnesota, and uh, great guy. I was always a big fan of like Gorilla Monsoon, guys like that. I loved Monsoon. I loved when I would hear Mean Gene and Monsoon doing the commentary, or even Vince, you know, it, it was Monsoon and, and Gene Oakland and Gorilla was just a great guy. He was a great guy. And he, his son, tragic what happened to his son who got killed in a car wreck, Joey Morello. But <laughs> I remember he got in a ring one time, and this is in the early 80s and Monsoon got in the ring and I'm trying to get out of the corner and he, and he had me locked in the corner. Wait a minute, you're not going nowhere. So I remember that, just faintly remember that. But after that, he was always commentating and he was just a natural. He was so good. He was so good and Mean Gene was, well, that's what he was, a commentator, but Monsoon was, was great. Gorilla. I'd seen that he was a, a special guest referee for a couple of your big matches. Right. Like with Backlund and uh, Pedro Morales. Yeah, that's that could have been, maybe it wasn't wrestling him, but I know he was a referee and he kept me blocked, <laughs> wouldn't let me out, and I could not get it. I couldn't go anywhere. That's one strong guy, real strong guy. 